Mickey, early day today, you had a quick draw with Nigel. Are you satisfied with the result? Um, yeah, I mean, it was a second black and I lost yesterday. Um, yeah, I got a reasonable opening, but uh, there weren't really any, any possibilities to play on somehow. So uh, then it's probably better to finish the game quickly and uh, save a bit of energy for the last two rounds. Right, absolutely. And now, Mickey, do you feel that this is a slight problem with chess, that even maybe if you want to play with black, uh, if white doesn't really do too much, there's very little that you can do on your end with the black pieces? Um, well, that wasn't really the case today. I mean, Nigel was trying to play, but uh, his opening didn't work out, I guess, as he hoped. But uh, yeah, it is a general problem. I mean, opening theory has gotten too big. And there are too many games where yeah, lower rated players are playing for a draw with white and it's, uh, I don't think it's a lot of fun for the spectators or the players really. Uh, but it's not so easy to resolve unless you play all games to an end and uh, replay draws. I don't think there's an obvious solution to it. Right, well, as spectators, we obviously love a long fight. But tell me one thing now, you and Nigel go back a long way. You've played many, many games together. How is it to play somebody you've had so much history with and played so many times? How does that affect you uh, before the round or in your preparation? Yeah, we didn't play so many games, actually. Uh, not as many as you would, uh, you would think. But uh, I guess we both played so many games in general, though, that... Uh, yeah, it's just it's just another game, really. Uh, you just see what happens. I don't think it makes such a such a big difference. Right. Well, thank you very much, and we wish you all the best for the remaining two games. Okay. Thank you.